What's going on YouTube? Kyle kind of coming at you with some more TCGO. Um, I'm still playing pool, I think, in this matchup. I think this was before I took out Terrakion, or might be after. I don't remember. Nope, it's after before I took it out. Anyway, as usual, I mulligan once, and I'm pretty sure I mulligan two more times. And, uh, well, yep, there's one mulligan. And, uh, yep, still playing poop because, uh, uh, my deck is still isn't done. Oh, only mulligan twice this time. Alright, it's cool. Start out with Mewtwo. I think I win the, the die roll or the coin flip. Whatever, or maybe he wins. I don't remember. Uh, let's see. Uh, I win, and uh, I'm playing against Durant. I'm like, well then, looks like it's time to win. Yep. But uh, I believe. All right, first I go for level ball, and I'm just trying to see if my other Mewtwo is in the deck. I think that's what I was doing, but uh, I don't think it is. So I think what I do is I play Mew, and I put a psychic energy on Mew. And then I switch out Mew. And, oh, I remember. I I go to see off a of Chandelure. That's what. Oh, jump off. Why did I do that? For oh, right, because I'm playing against Durant, and they have to kind of load up their bench. So I figure I might as well just put a jump off in the lost zone first before I put in a uh, poopy face tomato nose. Plug Chandelure. Yeah, there we go. But I probably should have Chandelure first, cause uh. If I had Chandelord first, then, oh, that's when I was doing stuff, like, it just automatically opened a page and I was recording, because my other video was done uploading, or whatever. Anyway, so, uh, what was I saying? Oh, Chandelord. I should have lost on Chandelord first, probably, because, uh, Chandelord can, uh, Flame Burst does 30 to the active Pokemon, 32 to 2 on the bench, and, uh, yeah, so I still don't have much of, uh, anything to do here. So I believe I am just going to put a DCE on my Mewtwo if I can stop being retarded. Oh, okay, or maybe not, and I'm going to see if Chandelure now. I really don't know why I didn't put that DCE on my Mewtwo. Like, I don't know what I was thinking there. Maybe I was thinking that he would pr want a loss remover or uh what do you call that thing? Crushing Hammer, because that's what Durant decks like to do. So Magby stays asleep, and uh, yeah, I think it wakes up here just in time for me to uh, kill it. And I top deck the uh, Prism Energy, which is fantastic, because now I can kill the uh, Silver Magby and hit uh, both of those Durants for 30, which is always nice. So I'm going to do just that, you know, hit a, uh, 30 damage all around, because that's fun. And there's my other Mewtwo EX, so yeah, that's the one that was prized. I was going to send in his uh, his other Durant, and what's going to happen now is that because he has a resistance to Psychic, the Flame Burst will only be doing 10 damage to him, but he also has Eviolite, so that means my Mew's Flame Burst is not going to be doing much at all, except to the Durant on the bench. So, I what I think I do here is after he twins, I don't know what he gets because he doesn't have to reveal, I think I'm going to put the DCE on my Mewtwo and switch out. Or retreat into Mewtwo and start X balling, possibly before he starts uh, doing too much stuff. Oh, then he plays a Shaman, and I'm like, "Fuck!" That Shaman's gonna give me a little bit of trouble here. And he's gonna retreat into Shaman now, because I think he can kill me with Revenge Blast. I believe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he can. I don't know why. Oh, he had the Synthesis first. That's what happened. So I'm going to level ball. Where did that come from? I guess I just top decked it. Wasn't paying attention. And I'm going to grab Ralts now because I want to get my Gardevoir set up. And now I'll put a DC on Mewtwo. And now I'm going to Flame Burst, I believe. Or maybe I was. Oh no, I was counting to see if. Uh, to see how many uh, Pokemon were on field to see if I could kill it with a, a mass attack. Or which I should have probably gone for the Leaf Guard there, actually. What was I doing? Because then it would have. Not done. Why did I do that? I definitely should have leaf guarded because his uh, revenge blast is only going to be doing 60 right now, and me would die if I really don't know what I was thinking there. What the hell was I doing? Anyway, he's just gonna revenge blast me for the KO, and I'm just gonna send in me to EX because uh, why not send in me to EX right now? So after that, I'm just gonna evolve my Curlia, and I'm looking. And I'm like, I think I can kill it. Let's put an energy on just to be sure. And I'm just going to X-Ball for the KO. 
take two prizes, and uh, now I'm winning the prize race. Of course, he can now use a um, another twins, but that's fine. So I just top decked another guard of war. Not top, wow, not top deck. I got one of my prizes, and one of them was guard of war. And I think that the prism energy was counting for a psychic energy at one point during. I don't know if that was a glitch or that might have been a different game, but. I think it was counting as a psychic energy when I needed it for like double colorless or whatever. And uh, yeah, it counted kind of towards Gardevoir's uh, psychic mirage thing. And I'm like, oh, that's kind of weird. Anyway, he's going to revive his uh, Shaman EX and put an Eevee Light on it. So that it's just going to be harder for me to kill. And then he puts a DCE on Durant and he's going to start trying to Vice Grip. And uh, yeah. I'm like, well then, Vice Grip. Now I'm checking to see how much uh, damage. Uh, X Ball will do this. Uh, thinking if I want to put it on a DCE onto that or my other Mewtwo, and I decide to. Oh, I'm gonna catch her after I put the DCE on that Mewtwo. Do I, am I gonna side drive? Probably gonna side drive. Oh no, I X Ball like an idiot. What the fuck was I doing? Oh, side drive wouldn't have KO'd anyway, actually, because that's Evil Light, so it didn't really matter. But he doesn't have energy on the Shaman. Oh, that's probably why I captured it in. Because he doesn't have energy on the Shaman, so he can't, uh, yeah, so he can't attack. Maybe that's what I was thinking. I really don't remember. Anyway, now I'm just going to kill, oh, okay, I guess I'm not going to kill the Shaman. What? Oh, Eviolite, right. I can't do math right now. And he's just going to retreat into his uh, Durian, and he's going to keep trying to Vice Grip me. And, uh, yeah, it's... Not exactly going to work out that way, because that's not what you're supposed to do with Durant. Uh, I think I just expo for the kill now, maybe? Oh, I'm going to side drive just because I can. Because, yep, side drive is cool. And I get another DCE off the prize, which is pretty cool. Uh, now, I'm reading Rotom, and it's pretty much like a mini Mewtwo, kind of. It's an uh, arrow attack, it's 20 damage, how many number of energy your opponent has attached to it. He's gonna black belt. I'm like, oh shit. So now his attacks do, I think, 60 more damage this turn, or the base power is 60, or something like that. Anyway, it's enough for him to kill off my Mewtwo, so that's that's pretty much all that really mattered at that point. So I'm just gonna send in my bench Mewtwo, and uh, I'm just gonna put a DCE on it, and uh, yeah, looks like that big X ball is about the KO. So this was a pretty straightforward match, uh, pulling against Durant, uh, yep, Durant's gay. Hello, little GK. But, no, serious buttons, I don't like Durant. But, uh, yeah, that's gonna be pretty much it, because all he has left is his Durant with, uh, one energy on it. He didn't, I don't think he ever devoured me once. But, uh, yeah, anyway, I'm running out of stuff to say, so that's gonna be pretty much it for this video. Uh... Yeah, you guys know the deal. Comrades, subscribe, and depending on it, all that good jazz. Okay, I'll catch you next time. Later.